What's up guys this is Ashish Tiwari here and you are watching Technotips ASP.NET MVC tutorial. In this tutorial I'm gonna discuss about how to perform jQuery data table server side searching. Okay so before watching this please watch my previous tutorial that is part 47 of this video series. In that video I have explained the basic example of data table server side processing. Okay so let's get started. So in the previous tutorial I have just created this example to enable uh, my server side processing using this attribute so B server side should be true and I have just passed this uh, S Ajax source as my URL and then f this function server data and this function call back function I'm just calling it after the Ajax success so let's have a view of it so here I got the record from the server so here you can see my paging will not work and here my searching is also not working okay so here in this tutorial I'll just handle it so first of all I just need to go to the controller and just need to put a breakpoint here and right now I'm just writing something here S yes. so here I just in the parameter I just got the value from this in this attribute as search okay so I'll just use this attribute for my uh, for performing the search functionality okay so let's stop it first of all we just need to check if params dot s search is not equal to null okay so in that case we will return different data okay just copy this and paste it here and first of all I just need to create the global object so list equal to new list okay and here I'll just use this list and inside this else otherwise I'll just return the simple list that is control X and just remove this okay so here when this search parameter is not null then in that case just before this select I'll just use dot where inside that I'll just put this lambda expression x dot let's say name should dot contains okay contains this params dot s search okay and let's say just run it so here in this case it will it will return me when the name matches with this parameter okay so we will check it so here you go and it's calling the controller right now this search parameter is null okay so function f10 so it's null so it will return me the simple data now continue this so here I got the simple data and now I'll just write a so I'll just receive a in the parameter and function f10 now this will go into this list and it will return me this record a okay 
so it will return all the name which consist a in its name okay so now I'll just apply it on all the column like department and then address also okay so let's uh, stop this and here I can also check for the other columns so x dot department dot contains department dot department name dot contains this params dot s search okay and then apply to other column that is my address so x dot address dot contains params dot s search now control kd and then rest thing would be okay so now let's run so to understand each and everything you just need to watch all the video in a sequence okay so let's so here you go and here it calls the controller search parameter is null and then continuing then here I'll write let's say India so the parameter is IN okay and here I just got the India as a parameter so IN so it's just matching the content IN India then here I N then I N I N okay so let's remove this breakpoint and try to search it okay let's I just search this is Smith so a Smith okay and I just want marketing okay then I just need to okay and I'm just trying to see the record from London okay so here I just so I'm just this filter is working for all the columns okay so that's all so that's all about I have just implemented the search functionality and in the next video you will see the paging okay so so first of all you just need to copy this attributes because we are using so in this tutorial I have used an extra uh, attributes that is in previous tutorial I have used only this attributes and in this tutorial I have used this as search okay and in the next tutorial I'll use use this okay rest thing you can boycott also you don't need to initialize all the list okay so that's enough for today hope you like this video and uh, uh, share this among your friend and help them too. Thank you very much. Have a great day.